with Christmas sweaters, fa la 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 Hello everyone, it is Chelsea Does Christmas, day three. What? That's insane. Day three already? Um, yeah, so you guys have decided it's hashtag Chelsea Does Christmas. I thought I would find out a little sooner, like slash in yesterday's vlog, um, but I didn't because I didn't upload my first one until pretty late that night. Anyway, I'm all festive. If you guys watched my vlog yesterday, you will see that I purchased this sweater. Um, I'm doing a shoot today. It's gonna be lots of fun. I have to wrap in it. Um, that's what opera degrees are for, apparently. You finish them, and then you wrap instead of singing opera. So, yay! I am heating up a muffin so I can eat it on the go. Let me see. I made banana muffins the other day, and oh, they smell so good. They smell so amazing. If there's one thing that I can make, it's banana muffins, that's for sure. I like to pretend that I can cook and bake, um, and I'm okay at it, but I haven't had a lot of time to do any of it lately. Okay, let me just show you what I'm bringing. I'm sorry, I'm like high energy. I'm trying to hype myself up. Um, okay, let me show you what I'm bringing with me. It's really festive. So I'm doing a couple of videos, and for my wrap video, I'm going to wear this sweater that you probably saw yesterday as well, and it has little Christmas presents on it, and you know why I picked this? Because they're wrapped. Ha 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 ha, get it? Christmas presents are wrapped, and I'm gonna wrap, okay. Um, yeah, so I'm wearing that, and then I'm going to wear this hat in it that my mom got me. There's a lady back home who knits these. It's pretty amazing. It's knit really, really well. Oh my goodness, I just realized I still don't have my nail polish taken off. Oh, crap, okay. Um, and then, for my, I have to do a, like, Christmas party type story, so I'm gonna wear my romper with that, and my, oh, my little, like, lace bralette. Oh, yeah, and I'm gonna wrap, I think I'm gonna wear, I'm not very wrapper, like, I don't have a lot of wrap clothing, so I'm going to bring my sunglasses and headphones and hope that suffice. I don't know, I think the fact that a, tiny little girl is going to be rapping is hilarious enough so yeah and yeah that's about it I'm going to put on um, my Smashbox lipstick again today let me see if I can find it in here the one um, this is infrared by Smashbox they're my favorite lipsticks and this is the one I've been wearing in my past couple videos so all right that's it I'm going to go and eat my uh, muffin now and I will talk to you really Soon. And I should probably take my nail polish off because this is just gross. Okay. Ugh. Hello, it's much later. I'm home and I've been home for a while. I was actually just binge watching Netflix for a little bit. Um, <laughs> yup, that's productive. But I got caught up watching the series, this Japanese Netflix series called Atelier. Oh my goodness. If you love fashion, if you love the anything to do with Japanese culture or um, this style or anything like that, you will love this series. I, oh, I wanna watch it all right now. <laughs> but unfortunately, that would take up too much time. Uh, that's all I wanna do right now. Do you ever get in those moods where you just wanna watch Netflix? Anyway, I didn't film it much today because I wasn't sure if I was allowed to and I felt kinda awkward asking. There were a bunch of people there and I didn't wanna I don't know, get in the way. You know what I mean? You ever feel like that? Um, but if you're interested in seeing the video, I'll definitely announce it on Vlogmas when it goes up, but you can check it out on much.com. I think that's where it's going to go up. We'll see. I'll keep you guys informed, but if you wanna keep checking back to much.com, uh, you can do that too. Also, how amazing is this? Like, LOL cats. Oh my goodness, oh, I love it. It looks like little handsomes on my shirt. Um, so I decided that since I have been in my apartment for the past couple vlogs, I really haven't gone out that much, I'm going to go out and look for some Christmas presents, I'm going to see if I can get advent calendars, and I'm going to film some of the Christmas lights at Dundas Square, because it always looks so pretty down there at night. Um, and I really want to go to HomeSense, I think there's a HomeSense down that way. So. Yeah, I'm gonna head down that way. So let's go. Not gonna lie, Toronto at Christmas looks amazing. Look at this. It's so cool. And then 
there's more lights over on this side. Oh, okay, not as many, but hey, this tree is pretty spectacular. You might have seen this in vlogs before. <laughs> the Eaton Center looks pretty darn cool now too. Um, I'm getting a couple of Christmas presents um, and I'm about to go into Indigo because um, I'm looking for a s certain present for Michael and I can't seem to find it anywhere else. So I'm going in here, but that's a secret because he watches my vlog so I don't want him to find out. He he he. Guys, I went out shopping and I forgot to buy the advent calendars. <laughs> Ah, I did get a, a couple of Christmas gifts though for Michael, so he 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 sneaky times, but I forgot the advent calendars. Ah, okay, maybe tomorrow. <laughs> I keep forgetting about them. Um, yeah, so I did get a couple of things for myself, not many though. Um, first I went to Amour Beauty, which is a little um, Asian beauty store here in Toronto. And I was looking for a really nice um, moisturizing serum or something. As you can see, my forehead is like super dry. I think I've said that in every single video. I'm sorry. But I decided to try out this serum. Um, it felt really, really great in the store when I tried it. And it's called Ten, I think. 10 it skin. I don't know. Let's see how this goes. It seemed to work okay on my hand, so we'll see. Um, apparently this goes before your moisturizer, so I'm gonna do a whole routine with this face tonight to try and get rid of my crazy dry skin. Um, I also picked up this really awesome pencil. Um, the girl told me it was a highlight pencil. It's called Baby Face. And it's also by It's Skin. Oh, is it by the same company? It is too. Wow, I was impressed by this company apparently. Um, okay, I'm just going to open it up. It has a little, if you hear that, I have something on the frying pan in the background. It's not burning. No worries. Um, I'm going to see if I can open this with one hand. It's a highlighter pencil, but it is the most gorgeous color and look to it I've ever seen. One second, I have to put you down. See, it's this really cool champagne-y color, but it looks even better when you swatch it. Let me see if I can do it here. I don't know if you guys are going to even see that magic. Oh, it totally does not show up properly in this lighting. Okay, let me see. Okay, do you see that shimmer? It's so pretty, but the camera isn't doing it any justice whatsoever, and the formula is so so nice. See, if I blend it out, I could totally use this as a base. Yeah, totally not doing it justice, but I'm very impressed with this pencil. So for Muji, I picked up just like your typical pack of, um, what are they called? Uh, cotton swab pad things, because I'm running low. And these are less expensive than the ones at the drugstore, and they feel a lot nicer. So I picked those up. And Muji had these 15% off. I mean, they're only $5 each anyway. But they had these new ones in with little stars on them. And what these are, they're little toothbrush holders, and you put your toothbrush in the little holes here, and they stand up. And I really like this color, because it was a neutral. And they have cute stars on them. Oh, I love it. So I'm gonna put these in my bathroom too, okay. Okay, I'm in my bathroom now. I'm going to get ready for bed. So first, I'm going to take off my makeup. I'm just gonna show you guys my little mini skincare routine I'm gonna do tonight. First, I'm going to take out my makeup with the Nivea Cleansing Water. It's supposed to cleanse, remove makeup, and moisturize to soothe the skin. I don't think it moisturizes all that much, but it's not too bad. So first, I'm going to take off my makeup with this. I like to loosen up my eye makeup first by just gently holding the pad against my eye. That's, that gets off some stubborn mascara. <laughs> So first I'm going to wet my face before I apply this. Okay, one minute. Now, I sometimes put this on a brush, but today I'm just going to use my fingers because they're a little bit more gentle on my skin. Uh, so I'm just going to use about this much and put it in my hands like this and then apply it to my face. Oh, it smells so good and it feels so nice. It makes your skin feel so soft. As you can see, it's already frothing up. It gets so thick. It's really nice. Okay, so I've taken off my face wash. 
And another little tip if you have dry skin, to wash your face with colder water because the hotter the water is, the more it's going to dry your skin. So use cooler water. And now I'm going to try this, the new It's Skin 10 Moisturizing Serum of some sort that I picked up today. Ooh, I'm really excited. There's nothing better than trying out new skincare, as long as it works. <laughs> oh cool, it has one of these little dropper things. So I think we'll try this much and see how it goes. Oh, no, I'm definitely going to need a little more than that. It's all trial and error. My skin's so dry, it just soaks it up right away. Oh, it feels so nice and cooling on the skin. I'm just going to pat it in like this. Hopefully, it will absorb nicely. Now, apparently after this, I'm supposed to apply a moisturizer. Um, I'm testing out this Midnight Recovery Moisturizer from Kiehl's. So I'm just going to put some of this. This is an eye cream, but I'm actually going to use this all over my face because it's nice and thick and I think it would be really nice on the rest of my face because why not right it's a sample I'm just gonna put it everywhere <laughs> let's hope this does wonders guys because oh winter skin is not a fun thing anyway guys that is all for today I'm gonna go and finish getting ready for bed and I guess I'll see you tomorrow. So, before I go, the question of today is, do you have any special things you do over Christmas to help pamper yourself or any awesome, like, relaxation tips that you guys really like to do over the holidays? Let me know in the comments down below because I love hearing about these things and maybe I'll try out some of your pamper tips myself. So anyway, um, that's all for today, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye!